Hello everyone, this is your host Jack reporting to you live from the photography studio. Today I want to share with you some useful tips about using a monopod, which is an essential tool for photographers and videographers on the go. As many of you may know, a monopod is essentially a single leg similar to a tripod that you can attach your camera to for added stability without the bulkiness of a full tripod. While it may seem like a simple pole, mastering proper monopod technique can really elevate your photos and videos. Let's get into the basics first. When setting up your monopod, you'll want to fully extend the legs to get your camera up to a comfortable height, usually around eye level for portraits. Be sure to securely lock each section so your gear doesn't accidentally collapse on you. Then firmly attach your camera to the mounting plate. Once your monopod is set up, it's important to maintain a steady stance with your feet shoulder width apart for balance. You can also tilt the monopod slightly towards or away from your body to get smoother looking shots as if using a tripod. Be sure to use your body for additional support as well by pressing the monopod against your chest. Some other techniques I've found useful are panning and tilting the camera smoothly to follow moving subjects. You can also lean against solid objects for extra support during long exposures. And don't forget to breathe. Take your shot at the end of your exhale to minimize shake. Now for some more creative ideas beyond the basics. Dynamic panning while tilting the monopod can capture moving action in a more dynamic way. Dramatic low angle shots are achievable by lowering the monopod near the ground or for unique perspectives, fully extend it high above your head. You can even add motion blur effects on purpose by panning during slower shutter speeds. The monopod also works great for macro photography by keeping close-up shots steady. And it's perfect for time-lapse sequences since your camera will remain consistently mounted. With some practice, you'll be impressing others by combining your monopod with accessories like fluid video heads or gimbals. Just remember to always keep a tight grip as balancing higher up can get tricky. So in summary, a monopod is lightweight and portable while still providing stability. Mastering its techniques through experimentation will take your photos and videos to new heights. I hope you listeners found these tips helpful for getting the most out of your monopod setup. Tune in next time for more photography tips and tricks. Until then, happy shooting.